Sylvia and I just made porridge. This is how we porridge. Chia seeds, blueberries, jam, peanut butter, agave syrup, cocoa powder, cinnamon, turmeric, porridge. <laughs> Wine for breakfast. Why not? Why not? Although it's actually beetroot juice. Now, where's the best place to eat in Brighton? That is a very hard question. I like Mushimas, because I like sushi. Where did we last eat in town? Infinity. No. <laughs> you have <laughs> absolutely no memory of I it. have pregnancy brain. Noodle soup. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah, there's this really good like Chinese soup place. It's extremely um, legit. You pay them money, they bring you noodle soup, bang like that noodle soup. And they give you a the soup in a bucket. Look at this guy, just literally across two lanes of traffic, like an absolute warrior. <laughs> Obviously there's Crocodile Cafe. At some point I'll shoot a vlog where I literally take people to Crocodile Cafe because it is probably one of the best places to get Italian in the Brighton area. Run by a bunch of guys from Rome. They all speak Italian, so they love my wife because she speaks Italian. It's like you go to someone's family home and they just feed you until you pass out. But yeah, there's Mukau. Um, they have this really good tofu, hoisin tofu salad. Tell them what happened the first time you, <laughs> tell them so what the happened first the first time, time you had the tofu salad. The first time I had the tofu salad, I actually got emotional and I shed a tear. <laughs> it was so good. It was so good. She literally took one bite and welled up. Yeah. That's good food, fam. I've had this thing in a box for quite a long time and I just haven't got around to getting it out. And today is definitely the right time to get out a random thing from a random box, which is this. For kids and me as well. It's going to be very exciting. It does tuning and looping and it sustains and holds everything in its tiny carcass that you should ever require, which is exciting. This is my makeshift office for, for sorting out my Kemper stuff. Uh, just updating the profiler and also hundreds of new delay settings. It's time to check out some of these brand new reverb and delay sounds. Loads and loads of new delays for the Kemper. I'm going to be using my black ghost fret because she asked me kindly. Namul, which is a really cool Korean, Korean place to get bibimbap. Yep. You want to get up? Yep. Let's do it. Hello. This is our friend Ellie. Hello. Hello again. No one else lives in Brighton. What are you doing? <laughs> We're just eating at Namul. Do you want to eat? Have you eaten? I think I'm going to get a takeaway burrito from La Choza. That's the thing I've been fantasizing about while being in New Zealand for two years. It's so strange in your accent. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's been two years. Most English accent I can. I'm just going to go through some of the delays. Uh, I've just got a regular kind of crunch, sort of martially tone, and um, man, I'm just—it's so nice. <laughs>
In summation, tons of fun for all the family, as long as the family is you. See you guys later. I uh, hope you had a fantastic New Year's Eve, Christmas, all that malarkey. Um, lots of Andertons reviews to follow at some point soon on Chappers Chappers Out.